forecast. All right, ABC 10 News pinpoint weather anchor Sierra Encina is joining us now with a look at the forecast. Hey, Sierra. Hey, Mia. Yeah, it's a beautiful night over San Diego right now. Let's take a look out of that sky cam. We've been enjoying some favorable conditions along our coastline. Right now it is 64 degrees. It feels just like that outside. Humidity at about 78%. Wind very slight, 3 miles per hour. Visibility for about 10 miles. Taking a look at the rest of our county. Up in Oceanside, it is 65 degrees. As we make it down the coastline, it is 62 in our South Bay in Chula Vista. 56 in Ramona and very warm still in our deserts. 92 in Ocotillo Wells. As we take a look along our coastline hour by hour, overnight we'll see things in the low 60s. By the time we make it out for that morning jog, it'll be 65 degrees. By lunch time it'll be 68 degrees in our inland communities hour by hour. By the time we make it out the door for breakfast, it'll be 61 degrees and by lunchtime it'll be 78 degrees. We do have some watches and warnings to break down, so it's going to be hot in our inland our mountain and our desert communities. We have an excessive heat warning in our mountains and deserts. So for those of you at home, let's prepare by hydrating now because the heat is going to impact us. The temperatures will be 10 degrees above average in our inland communities starting on Tuesday. There will be some relief along the coastline if you are looking to beat the heat as we take a look along our coastline along the next seven days. So we're going to see the marine layer and that's because we have a trough in conjunction with a Catalina eddy that's spinning up on our coastline right now. So we will see the marine layer into the morning hours and it'll even make its way into some of our inland communities and this will cause temperatures to be below average for some of our coastal communities. But taking a look along the next seven days along our coastline, we will see things at about the mid 70s, our overnight lows in the mid 60s and our inland communities over the next seven days. We're going to see things in the 80s, but they will top out to about 89 as we head into next weekend. So when we really see things start to heat up on Tuesday, let's take a look at some of those temperatures in our inland communities. In Escondido, it'll be 86 degrees on Tuesday, 83 in Fallbrook, 89 nice and warm in El Cajon, 96 very warm in Ramona, 91 forecasted in Valley Center. Like I said, as we head into next weekend, we will see a high of 89 degrees. In our mountain communities, we will see things tomorrow at 81 wind gusts up to 30 miles per hour, but we will see things climb into the 90s all the way up to 98 by Saturday in our desert communities triple digits and that excessive heat warning that means to make sure that we are checking twice to check on our kids and checking on our dogs. We will see a high of 118 by next Saturday, Tuesday when that excessive heat warning kicks in. We will see a high of 